It gives us great pleasure to share that Virginia Moss has celebrated 50 years of dedicated service as a Spotsylvania County school bus driver. Tonight, we'd like to take a few moments to highlight her career. And at this time, I'd like to ask Ms. Moss to come on up as she's doing. That's why you're such a good bus driver, because you can anticipate everything. I'd also ask uh, Mr. Kenny Forrest, our transportation, to come up as well. Thank you, Mr. Forrest. 50 years ago, Virginia Moss began her occupation as a Spotsylvania school bus driver when her youngest child started school. Mr. Raymond Chenault hired, trained, and was her first supervisor. During those times, within the county's transportation department, there was no designated bus driver uh, trainers. Mr. Chenault's colleague, Mrs. Leach, requested his assistance with the recruitment of bus drivers who would also be willing to work within the Spotsylvania High School cafeteria. Well, you're multi-talented. <laughs> Mr. Chenault didn't stop after employing Virginia as a bus driver. He then offered her a second job as a part-time cafeteria worker. She accepted without hesitation. Her days then consisted of a morning bus route, serving lunches, and an afternoon route to return the children home from school. Virginia served as a Spotsylvania High School cafeteria staff member for 39 years. So that in its own right deserves, I think, a lot of recognition. All right. But she was just getting started. Um, Virginia has driven for 50 years and has enjoyed, enjoyed every moment. Believe it or not, her favorite age group to drive is high school. Throughout her career, she has had four supervisors within the last 50 years. Two other bus drivers that she recalls starting shortly after her as bus driver colleagues include Sally Wright and Pat Wheeler. She has countless memories countless memorable moments, I should say, during the years of her driving. Most recently, while out to dinner at a local restaurant, she knows a young lady watching her. That could be scary. Okay. <laughs> um, the young lady then approached her and asked, are you Mrs. Moss, my former bus driver? Virginia then replied that she was. The young lady then went on to share how much she meant to her Mrs. Moss meant to the young lady, and enjoyed having her as her bus driver. This former student then paid for Virginia's meal as appreciation for her years of service at her bu as her bus driver. Over the last 50 years, Virginia's most frightening moment of driving was during a tornado warning that required her to go into the school and anchor down with the children. She has driven up to three generations in some families. The one thing that she loves most about her job is the children. She may not have birthed them biologically, but they are her children. In the most recent years, Virginia was given the opportunity to accompany her daughter-in-law, Diane Moss, who's also here this evening, also a bus driver, and she's an activity bus driver, and Ms. Moss became, an, uh, for a moment at least, an activity bus aide. She enjoyed her time working with Diane, but quickly discovered one thing that she disliked most about being an aide, the bumpy ride. <laughs> When Virginia is not driving the school bus, she enjoys spending time with her husband of 62 years, Stanley Moss. Mr. Moss, I'm going to have you stand up just for a minute here. <laughs> and of course, their family. You know, behind every good woman, there's a good man, they say. Well, I think it might be back. <laughs> She's the mother of six children, 10 grandchildren, and 15 great-grandchildren. Virginia is an avid Golden State Warrior fan. Her favorite player of all time is Steph Curry. You better get home and pray a little bit because they need some help. <laughs> She's a dedicated fan who spends countless hours watching their games and cheering them on game after game. The daily time spent with the children going to and from school has generated lifelong memories that she continues to cherish. Throughout her 50 years of being a bus driver, she remains passionate about what she does and continues to enjoy this journey. As the saying goes, choose a job that you love and you will never have to work a day in your life. 
Virginia continues to do just that. Thank you, Mayor.